Hi everyone, welcome to the cocktail reception here at Automotive Logistics and Supply Chain Global right here in downtown Detroit. We're on the 72nd floor of the GM Ren Center here, overlooking the southern border, yes, you heard me right, southern border to Canada, one of the few parts of the US where Canada is to the south. And we have a great crowd here tonight, kicking off what's gonna be three days of intense networking, lots of discussion and insights all about automotive logistics and supply chain right here in North America and beyond. The industry is so desperate to get together. Of course, there was a COVID disruption, but it's, it's actually been every kind of disruption. Uh, we've been short of semiconductors, short of truck drivers, short of labor, rail issues, ocean issues, you name it, you know it, I don't need to go through it. Now is the time to work together on it, and that's exactly what we're gonna do over the next couple of days. Uh, we're gonna be bringing you highlights here on social media and on YouTube uh, from our speakers, from our content, summing up what's going on. And what I just wanted to do right now is give you a couple of key topics and themes we're gonna be talking about. Mitigating risk and disruption, that's gonna to be top of the agenda, and we've seen the industry work together in brand new ways to pivot away from disruptive modes, whether it's switching from truck, to, to air or from ocean to air where needed faster than ever before, working with new suppliers to do it. Um, this, this sort of system integration communication has been more important than ever. But at the same time, we're not just gonna look at what's challenging people day to day, day in, day out, but also the, the bigger trends, sustainability, electrification. One of our exciting speakers, the day one keynote, is, uh, um, is Jacob Ward from the, from the Department of Energy, from a brand new Office of Manufacturing and Energy Supply Chains, giving us insight on what government policy in the US is doing to support the transition to electrification and, and carbon-free carbon freight, as well as uh, energy security. Really important. But from there, we're gonna, walk, we're gonna go right into intense discussions with the likes of General Motors, Stellantis, Toyota, IAC, the whole range. Uh, talking about optimizing the supply chain and logistics. Working together is gonna to be the theme that comes back to it again and again. That's what this sort of cocktail reception hosted tonight by Kuhn and Nagel is all about. That's what automotive logistics and supply chain is all about. So I hope you'll follow us here on, our, on, our, on LinkedIn or if you're watching this online, come back to our website. We're gonna be sharing articles, video highlights, and eventually even on-demand videos from, from the event. Uh, it's the biggest event we've ever done. We're talking about more than 600 people here the next couple of days, and even more watching it online. So lots of opportunities to get involved and catch up on what you miss. But for now, I think I've got a drink waiting for me. I'm gonna get back to that and get back to some of these great, interesting people here. This is Christopher Ludwig signing out for now from Detroit. We'll see you here real soon.